So the uh, question here is, what question is Philonous trying to answer and what is his answer? So in case you don't know this by now, uh, Philonous is, well, but neither Philonous nor Hylus exists, right? They're fictional uh, names drawn up merely for uh, this dialogue. Uh, Philonous serves as Barclay's mouthpiece, right? Everything Barclay believes he's using Philonous to, uh, as his, you know, protagonist, as his uh, advocate. A uh, high list is kind of the opposing viewpoint. So the question is, you know, what is, what question is Philonous trying to answer? Yeah. Well, you might think that he's trying to ask the question whether objects exist and, and that no, objects don't exist. No, that's not what he's trying to do. Now, Philonous thinks objects exist. Right? He thinks that there are things that are out there uh, that exist, and okay, great. Um, but the question is whether they're material. Right? So Philonous is asking whether material substance exists, whether material objects exist. Uh, and his answer is, is no. Now to be clear, he thinks objects exist. The guitar behind me, the wall, my shirt, the sun, all of this exists, it's just not material. Now, for Barclay, what objects are, are ideas. There's minds and ideas. That's uh, what exists. <clears throat> Not material substance. Now, uh, you might think this is a little strange. You might think that he's reducing us up to skepticism. No, he's dead serious, right? Objects exist. They're just not material.